What is going on, everybody? Razor69 on your 12 here with Paper. This was some little random game that I saw on Game Jolt. Looked kind of interesting. All I know about it is it's a about a paper man living a paper dream. So let's get into it. I always felt truly alive when I was flying high. Gliding through the clouds and under the stars. Being one with the sky. I like his voice. He's a very nice voice. After all these years I have been here, that is what I'm missing the most. Paper. I never thought that my dream would turn into my prison. Hey. I wanted to become the pioneer of the floating islands and unveil the mystery around them. These islands have been avoided by other pilots. The winds are unpredictable and strong. But I wanted to uncover the mystery. No matter what, I thought I was prepared. But then... Oh. But then... It. So what happened? You crash landed? Aw, oh, he's a little old man with his paper mustache. That's a sweet paper mustache. Whoa, hey! Bloop fridge just turned into butterflies and flew away. Well, okay. <laughs> Remember when you were a child and you ran around and you pretend that you were an airplane and you stuck your arms out like that? That's exactly what he's doing. It's locked. I must need a key then. Where is there a key? That's not a key. Oh, what? It's down here. He sounds like he's just, you can tell that he's just walking on paper this whole time. Ah, hey, there's a key. Good ya I got the key. Never understood these drawings. Whoa, hey, easy. Uh, they look like gears and a plane drawing and, come on camera, cooperate with me. Oh, this camera is extremely sensitive. Barely poke it. Barely poke it. There we go. Okay, there we go. Moving on. Unlock the gate. Now, this game was actually developed by a couple of college kids. So, I mean, for, for what it is, this is actually really cool looking. I like this. Hey, there's my blueprint. Good -ish. Gotcha. Okay, now it showed one over... Is that a chicken? Kick the chicken! Kick the chicken! Kick the chicken! That is an ugly looking chicken. And I just kicked its ass. Okay, well that's a water system. Pipe goes into the water. Uh, how is there water on paper? Wouldn't it just, like, sink through? There's a big button. Aha! Kick the big button! And there goes my blueprint. Where are you going? Blueprint, come back! Okay. Going this way. There's a blueprint. There's my blueprint. Right. Moving on. I've been alone for so long. It's just me. Nature. It's been thir- Holy sh- Height. Oh, wrong button. Don't kick the blueprint. Grab the blueprint. 30 years you've been stuck here? Is that what you're trying to say? Grab the blueprint. There's one right here. 
Is that what I'm getting out of that? Is you've been stuck here for 30 years. Pretty print. Alright, that looks like that's already back around something this way. I think I saw my last blueprint over here. Did I? Up, oh, up. Oh, I saw a mushroom. Up, oh, there it is. Gotcha, blueprint. Energy core and a steering wheel. Whoa. Off to New Lawns. Lighthouse. I would say that may possibly be my energy core that I need. So do I gotta come over here and turn the power off? I did, I just turned the power off. Ugh, excuse me. Sorry, I literally just ate food before I sat down to record this, so. I got a little bit of the burps in my belly. And I just drank a lot of juice. <laughs> Cool, now I won't get electrocuted when I go and grab that. Alright, little dude, let's go! Although he doesn't have a jump button. He's got a grab and a kick. Kinda would like a jump button. So I could jump! Wait, if I jump into the wind, would I just float away? Because I'm made out of paper. Like, is that a thing? Those are cardboard doors. And apparently I'm out of breath. Yeah, what do I expect? I'm an old man. I'm an old withered man. I can't quite run like I used to. Hey, my little plane. Off to the little plane. Oh, look at the water and the reflection. Hey, my steering wheel. Grab that. Hold on. Hold on. Hold your horses one moment. <laughs> it won't let me go any farther. Wow, that is really detailed in the water. That is so cool. Hey, what's over here? I should really fix that thing soon. Uh, you think? It looks like that is an expansion. Now I know they're still working on this game, it's not a full game yet, so they... Ooh, there's more stuff over there. Ooh, look, a squirrel! <laughs> um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, this game's not quite done yet, so they're definitely gonna be adding more to it, and it looks like there's already spots where they're gonna be expanding the map to explore some more. I'm gonna come over here and put my stuff in my plane and take off on my makeshift ramp. Whee! And lift off, and that was game. Mayday! We're going down! Crash landing! Oh no! That wasn't here? Are you talking about the giant cave? Didn't I just come out of this? Or no, I came through the stores, didn't I? Where did I come from again? Whoa. Oh, hey. Easy there, camera. There is a firefly leading my way. Hey, my energy core ended up in a cave. Because logic. These look like toilet paper rolls. Or paper towel rolls, more or less. I have a bad feeling about this. So... I'm gonna die? Cogs. Engines? Exhaust fans? What's this? This is a cockpit. I'm inside the mountain. And that's a cockpit. That is definitely a cockpit. Wait a minute.
the mysterious floating island is a plane. The, the island that he spent 30 years on and wanted to uncover its mystery was a plane the whole time. Was that it? That was it? That was game? Aw, that was cute. That was awesome. Yep, that was it. That was game. That was... Yeah, that was actually really interesting. I like that. That was cute. That was definitely really cute. But anyways, thank you everybody so much for watching. And until next time, this is Razor, signing off.